Hi guys, it's Allie with Chaos Monkey, and I was just doing my um, Crochet Society unboxing for October. Um, I got it on today, which is the 5th, so just to give you a heads up on the shipping. And all I did was take it out of the white packaging, the bubble mailer. I haven't looked, and I haven't spoiled myself, so we'll go ahead and take a look at the box. Again, it's got the rose gold... Um, Foil embellishments, and of course it's by Bella Coco, which I'll link all this stuff down in the description box below if you want to check it out. And I'm just gonna, whoops, I'm just gonna kind of show you all the sides here. Now it is overcast, so it might be a little darker. Um, may not be reflecting true colors here. But as you can see, it's some type of fern type of um, theme going on. So we'll go ahead and put it up in there. And then the inside says, let's get cozy and to share on hashtag crochet society. And then we go ahead and get this open. And we have our little... Um, Tidbits are ephemera. So this time it's in pink and blue. I'll go ahead and scooch those over. And let's get cozy as the theme. And here's the card. They give you one of these every month just to show you the US, US and UK crochet terms because the patterns are in UK. So it's just showing you the conversion. So that's cute. And I'll go ahead and get this out of here. So we've got, here's the yarn, it's Bergier, I have no idea how to say that, so sorry if I messed it up, from De France, um, DK, says a size 3, made in France, in the color Griol, or Grioli, um, it's like a, it's coming out pretty true to color, it's a, a yellow, but it's more of a golden yellow. And then we've got the same thing in blue, which is Q or Q. And then the white is Everest. You can see that. And the yardage on these guys, what's the yardage? So it's size 4 crochet hook and knitting needles, made in France. Um, there it is, 136 yards. And it is 40% wool, 30% acrylic, 30% polyamide. So, and that's the same for all of them, I'm assuming. Yes. So that's the yarn in these three colors. And then we've got some stuffy. Once again, I show the, um, the, <laughs> the... <laughs> code for that you get a exclusive pass code for all the video tutorials for the club so um, I don't know I just don't want to give away anything I shouldn't be so I might have to you might see some editing right there but the hook this month is a three millimeter in pink and white splotches it's still in the rose gold And then we've got a little container, it looks like a pencil sharpener, so I'm going to just turn it. Yes, we got a little pencil sharpener with the same theme, this is in rose gold on top in pink, because we have pencils. So this month we got a blue pencil and a little pencil that matches our crochet hook with a pencil sharpener. And then we've also got little notebooks. Aww. So let me slide this off of here. And you can see that this matches the theme on the box. It matches all the themes. That's so cool. Okay, so if we look inside, this one says corner to corner. Here, if you can see it. And it's got graph paper. That's really nice, graph paper. And then the pink one says sketches. And it's just plain, so you can do your sketching. 
And then the last one says tapestry. And this one has, oh, cool to check that out, circles. For tapestry crochet, I guess. Um, it kind of gives you a little example on the cover. So we've got three of those. And our, aw, our marker is the same we get. It's like a rubber with the lobster claw. And this time it's a little bare in the colors. It's in the pink and the blue themed little colors. It's so cute. We got some eyes, and then here's the pattern book, and it looks like, if you guys want to see here, looks like we got a polar bear stuffy, or a pillow, or a hat. Here's the close-up of the bear. He's cute. I might make him... He's a real polar bear. And then everything in the box, which has the code again, so I don't want to try to accidentally give that away. Or you can do that. Is that tapestry crochet? I don't know. Let me see if I can find the pattern. Yes, it is tapestry crochet, which I don't think I've ever done tapestry crochet, so that might be fun to do. And then the divine hat, which I'll show you guys a close-up of the hat. Or, I'm sorry, a divine, alpine hat. I don't know where I got divine from. I can't read today. So that's awesome. And you can see some of the pictures she did from people who finished on Instagram. She pulled some of those out for the the magazine. So that's it. So, um, again, not disappointed. There's a lot in here for the price, and um, I love the little notebooks, you know, for the the gifts. I love the fact that they're all different um, textures or patterns or whatever you want to call them, so that you can use them for different things. Um, I'm just going to put them back in the band to keep them all together. So yeah, it's, it's um, again with the three patterns and a good variety of patterns for whatever you feel like you want to make. And I'm just going to kind of try to squeeze these back in. Um, so yeah, yeah, I'm very happy with it. I'm not disappointed at all. Um, but this is probably going to be my last month only because um, they keep canceling me every month, kind of like the way Mary Maxim was doing. They keep sending me a letter that says uh, when they try to auto bill, even though it should go through, that it's not going through, and then uh, it gets canceled, and then I have to get back online and keep trying to restart it, even though it rejects my card for no reason. So, um, you know, I, that may not be anything to do with Crochet Society. That might be because I have this happen with all of my monthly kits, except for um, Crate Joy, I didn't have a problem with. But when I was with Mary Maxim, all of a sudden I was having that problem with Mary Maxim. When they would bill me, they would say it didn't go through when it did and, and cancel me after they ship it. Same thing with this. It's like um, they ship this one and I guess try to bill for the next one because then I get a cancellation letter with this box. So, um, plus, I think I'm just kind of done with testing it out. Um, I'm not going to be able to get that in there. It's so stuffed, you guys. I'm not going to be able to get that in there. Um, so I think I've kind of had my my fill on, you know, testing out this this particular box. So um, I'm going to move on to a different uh, crochet club. So if you guys have any suggestions, leave them in the comments below because, you know, sometimes I search and I Google for them, but there's some that just don't pop up that people will tell you about. Um, to try a different crochet club for um, next month. So, and I, I do have Knit Crate, and I'm keeping that one, but this, that's kind of the one I'm going to keep, which also I don't have a problem with. That one always comes out perfectly every month, no problems, they never cancel me. Um, but for some reason, some of the others just, I get canceled every month and have to resubscribe or restart over. Um, part of the reason why I canceled Mary Maxim other reasons, but, um, and because I just wanted to kind of move on. I'd had Mary Maxim for a long time. So that's it for this month for the crochet box. Um, 
super awesome and uh, look forward to making some of the stuff in here. When I do, I will post the video. So I will talk to you guys later. Bye.